In this week's video we check out the Baby Detlas Alpha, the A6820. Darren makes Tash angry and we visit Empire RV to look at the most expensive motorhome I've ever been in, the STX3 pop-outs. £665,000. You want this one? I reckon we can come to an agreement <laughs> on this one. Look at it though, look, look. Sofa, chilling out, just think. We can be chilling out over there, the cats can be chilling out over here. Like, they don't even need the dashboard. Like, Millie can be sitting up here, not in the kitchen, waiting for us to cook. Oh, Rose... stop it. Rosie can handle this, can she? Rosie can handle this. Behind you there is a fridge freezer. This one? Yeah. Is it? Oh look, they put some food in for us as well. <laughs> for our new van. Oh, I like the roof. It's That's cool. Electric sunroof. Or should I say skylights? Yeah. Yeah, full electric. Uh... Claire and Aidan would be foaming if we got this. Because <laughs> our friends at like, Concord, and they're oh, always okay. like, oh, we got a porcelain toilet. I've got a massive travel. <laughs> Heated floors. Hey. Heated floors. Heated floors. Aircon in every unit. A TV that appears as if from nowhere. Out of there. This is what you did yesterday with the, uh, the Birchover. We started at the Birchover S, and we're like, oh, this is brilliant. <laughs> and then we ended up at the 78 the grand one, and we're like, the yeah, I was. Classic. <laughs> yeah. I can upgrade the T5 and then you can upgrade the Sonic. Yeah. Boom. It's tight behind us. It's yeah. fine. Yeah. I do like this though. It makes it proper. You'd need great. to go bigger than a, a transporter though. If you're going to tow a camper oh, van no, behind you, then that's it would look in... silly. So at least if you had a Ducato, it would look a little bit like it should be there. But, but has the Ducato got the brand? It ought to be a Sprinter or something like that. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Sprinter. Let's go to Ducato. Oh, maybe an RP then. We'll go RP. Yeah. We'll tow an RP behind. We can get a Rebellion. <laughs> the, um, we can tow it behind. The Scania that's coming in is all in black. Oh, with nice. All the, chrome. the exhaust on the side. And he's had it, he's had the side matte black on the windows mm. to match his black uh, Lamb of Discovery brand new <laughs> that he tows. Uh. <laughs> oh my days. Yeah, I'm getting a rebellion. And we have to say a massive thank you to James from EmpireRVs.co.uk for letting us on the stand and showing us around their gorgeous RVs. So this is potentially the only vehicle we would defect from Adria for. The Alpa. A Six, that is a bit of a mouthful, the, the model number, I'm not going to lie, but I think they all are really. So you get a U-shaped lounge at the back, but you still get a garage, which is what I like. I think we might even have some riffraff in here. <laughs> yeah, I said, did say there was some riffraff in here. <laughs> oh, and that's it. And then I love the fact that you're... We're just discussing your, uh, your new moho. Mm. Yeah, it's nice, isn't it? The only thing I don't like is the amount of roof lights because that's not good for solar. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So yeah, and then you're up here and it's like you're out the way. And I love it as well because you get like a little, you can put like your coffee. So would you sleep that end or this end? Uh, or is it interchangeable really kind of? Yeah, I don't think it matters too yeah. much. I mean, I'd probably naturally sleep this end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because then you'd be shimmying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Feet straight to that bed. And you've still got like your shelves up here for all your taps. I don't need storage still around. 
Oh yeah, there's loads of storage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it because you can even keep that shut off without having to have steps down. Mm. So it's not, yeah. it's not intrusive. And when the cats annoy you, you just lock them in the cab. <laughs> <laughs> that makes a fair shout. Oh. And then... Ta-da! Oh, they must be huge. Mm. Whoa! Jesus! That is Look at all that. John won't let you fill anything, put anything in it. No. No. No, because of the weight. I've only got, Whoa. it's only 4.8 tonnes, so he won't have enough weight. You've got oh, all, your, all your tins and everything in there. Mm -hmm. Oh, your bins. Your bin system. Does that pull out as well, that shelf there, or is that just a shelf? No, it's just a shelf. Mm. Yeah. You got that. And then the bottom one's going to be huge. Yeah, yep. waste, that'll waste, be. Waste tank. Why have you got access to that there? Because it's in the floor. Because it's all in the floor. It's fully look, winterized. Look at the size of that. So you get, because it's a double floor, it's all heat, so it's perfect for winter touring. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All, um, but yeah, look at the size of that. I mean, it's massive. I put the girls in there when they get rowdy. Time I out. could go in there. To be fair, I could put you in there when you're annoying. Yeah. See, that's why I like a double floor as well. Mm. That's what I'm looking at at the moment. Yeah. Getting a double floor. Yeah. Because you've got Audi heating, which John likes, but you probably also have. I don't know, you might have diesel heat as well, I'm not sure. Yeah, well, you can add that. Yeah, only wet heating. Yes. You like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah it's much better. You reckon that's good? Because yes. I've been looking at a few that have got it. that. Yeah. So you'd say double floor and if you get double floor and Audi heating, go for that. Oh, is this your Audi fresh tank? Uh, yes, sorry, yeah, the fresh is up there. Uh, so, so it's all it's, internal. You still get the separate shower and... Yeah. Yeah, so for us with the, um, the girls... Easy. One question. Garage. Yeah, it's, it's still quite big, yeah. 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 Get a wardrobe as well. I do like this as a, like with the, the lamp. What did she say? She told you to get one of these. It does, oh, this is putting up the fight for what I want, then she gets like, one. Like against the Catargo, if I was to pick, pick new, then this is putting up a good fight. I oh, know, yeah, uh, but you want A-class. Yeah, no, but I mean... But you've said you want no, A-class, no, no, so you've got to go for an A-class now. I got it, I got it. You buy ours, <laughs> you buy this. Yeah, we'll sell it to you, Daz, for £150,000. <laughs> How much is it? Oh, no, 130. Oh, oh Mates okay. rates. I tell you what. Mates rates. 120 and we'll put the rest in. You can have our van. Yeah, because I said the price fair. first, so we'll give it to you for 20 grand less than... Yeah. <laughs> or I'll just buy this and then just have purchase <laughs> like that. <laughs> Are there current layouts like this in circulation in the second-hand market? Not at the moment, is there? What exactly this? No, no, not exactly, but similar as, as similar as you can get probably. Are there this kind in circulation already out there in in second hand? Frank, obviously I'd Frankie never... do one very similar uh, with the overcam. Oh, they do actually. Um, but the design of it is a big hump like yeah. yours, yeah. Uh, and it goes down. Uh, Frankie do one with a double floor. Yes, yeah, most of the Frankies have got double floors. I love the double floor, I do Yeah, love it. It, the storage you get in it, and I like yeah. the fact that all the tanks are internal as well. In terms of winterisation, using it in the winter, a double floor is uh, another nice. game changer. Yeah. yeah. yeah well, but obviously you, you have got the height. It is three point, yeah. just over 3.2 metres high. So it's quite tall, So it's, but... you've got to put that into your sat nav, and there's going to be some some bridges that we can get under that we won't be able to get under anymore. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You just go a different route. It's, you know, it's doable. Yeah. yeah, it is what it is, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. You make the compromise. Yeah. <clears throat> but it's pretty impressive to get the lounge, yeah, the garage, yeah, yeah, yeah. That and lounge. the beds all in one van. Yeah, the lounge is better than what we've got because obviously we've got half the net, so it's smaller. Um, just but then we have got... Sitting there watching Armageddon. I could see you in the corner, chilling out. Oh my god. Titanic. <laughs> oh god. Bodyguard. Oh. Love actually. Bit of love actually. Oh, right, that's it. Cut. Right, <laughs> that's enough of that video. A bit much. <laughs> <laughs>